Hey, how do you guys like your eggs cooked? I hope you like them hard boiled, cause uh, this thing's on fire. We got a level 85 fire wyvern egg here, incubating up, and we have just a little bit of time left. This thing's gonna hatch right in front of us. I think we got like less than a minute left now, if I'm right, let's go see. Let's see, eh? Yep, less than a minute, just a few seconds left. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Or a girl, oh girl. I don't know if it's gonna be a boy or a girl, but I do know it's gonna come out as a level 85, which is higher than the other wyverns we have. Any second. Come on. Aww. There it is. Let me imprint real quick. I'll cancel the naming process right now. Let me turn these off so they don't burn up. Oh, crap. Come on. Come on. Off, off. Come on. Oh, God dang it. Come on. Off, off. Off. God. Uh, uh. Come on. There we go. Alright, come on. God dang it. Come on. And off. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Just get off. Uh huh. That's what she said. All right, let me get a little milk action going and come over here and try to, let's walk around the torches and then come over here. You want a little jinky poo? Here you go, glug, 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 glug. Let's see, what do we got? Health is all right, let's see. Health is pretty stable and food was stable too. Let me see, we got a male. All right, it's a male. Level 85, behavior, is it following? Yes, it is. All right, come on, come over here. Come here. Come and see mama. Aww. You're so cute. Oh, you wanna give me a kiss? Mwah. Thank you. Yes. Oh, hey, what are you doing? There we go. All right, there he is, guys. Level 85, little baby wyvern. Got some stuff to do today, so I gotta make sure he's okay on his own first. And then I can do a little, I have to do a little house rearranging. I'm gonna move my bed and stuff up here. And then, uh, let's see what other adventures we can get into. Let me make sure his health and his uh, food are stable first before we take off. Let me check that out. All right, his health's all right, and his food's okay, not going down drastically. So he should be okay on his own here for a little bit, I would assume. All right. Well, buddy, give Mama a kiss. Mama's gonna get to work. Give me a kiss. Thank you. And one more. Mm, thank you. Well, the weather took a turn for the worse, as you can see. Let me show you what I've been doing. I made a little storage box for all my weapons and some supplies I might need for going on an adventure. Brought my bed up here and the smithy. Made a little bookshelf here for my blueprints. A couple other storage boxes. I made three forges to start cooking some metal ingots up for me. Moved my cooking pot in the corner there and built a couple fires, cooking some steaks on there right now. I just wanted to kind of move all my stuff up here on top of the trap so I wouldn't have to keep going from up top to down below to get some supplies if I needed them. And the reason I have the forges going, the reason I have three of them going, is to cook up metal ingots so I can hopefully start making a fabricator because I need to step up my game in my technological advancements. Because I'm still working with some bare bones stuff. I mean, I have the long neck rifle, and I have a couple other things that are, you know, pretty useful. But I need a fabricator so I can step up my technological advancement side. I need to start getting some more high tech gear. Holy crap! I'm freezing to death. Oh, give me my fur armor real quick. Holy cow! Come on, get that on you. There we go. All right, now I'm good. Oh, baby wants something. Oh, he wants some cuddles. Baby, want some cuddles? I can give you that for free. Here's a free cuddles. Here, give me a kissy. All right, kissy kiss. You like that? Oh, yeah, he liked that. All right, well, as you can see, the wyvern grew up a little bit as I was rearranging stuff around here at the base. All right, let me check him out real quick to see if I can take off. Okay, he wants care in about 40 minutes. His health is good. His food's all right. So I think he'll be all right left alone for a little while. Uh, like I said, I wanted to start making a tech fabricator. And like I said, I have the forges cooking a bunch of metal because once I get that fabricator going, 
Then I'm going to be building all sorts of stuff, and I'll need plenty of metal to make all that stuff. All my technological advancements, like I said. Um, I got, still got my preserving bin over here. Um, let me see, let me check out the smithy and see what I need for the fabricator, because I think I still need a couple things. Come in here, check out this guy. All right, so I have enough oil. I have spark powder, it's just not in here. Uh, metal I think I'll be good on and cementing paste. I think I might have some in the mortar and pestle. I know I need crystal But cementing paste I think I might have enough in the mortar and pestle over there If not I have enough stuff in the smithy to make some more Okay, no looks like I'm out Okay, I just need uh, keratin and stone which like I said I think I still have some over here in the smithy and I'll just steal some from you. Give me that. I'll take this. Thank you very No. Give me the stone. Give me the keratin. Thank you. Okay, come over here. Let me throw this in here. I'll get this making up a bunch. And then after this crafts up, I'll be good on cementing paste because I still have three over there in the smithy. And that should be enough for the fabricator at least. I'll probably need more when I start building stuff. But it is what it is. So... I'm good on spark powder, I know I have a lot of that. I'll be good on metal and cementing paste. So now all I need is just the crystal. So, I think I know where I can go to get some of that. I think I gathered some of that at one time when I was making my castle a long time ago. So, up, up and away, and off we go to the lighthouse. Ready to control, do we have clearance for landing? 10 4, clear on runway 1. And here we go. And land. Anywhere. Land right there. Anywhere. Thank you very much. Alright, now I have a storage box up here. Let's see what I got in here. Uh, I don't see any crystal up here. We got some silica pearls. I could use that when I get a fabricator. Um, we have some blueprints in here that would be nice. I'll probably leave some of these weapons and torches here. I'll probably leave the chitin armor here too. I think it... I only got the legs though. I don't know where the other stuff is gone. Probably got it taken off of me when I died. Of one of my billion times of dying in this game. Um, what do I got in here? Mm, spark powder? I don't need that. Alright, let's see. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Okay. Bed there. Uh, fire. More spark powder? Nope, nothing. You got robbed. All right. Uh, 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 parkour. Oh crap! Oh crap! Uh, uh. Okay. Um, metal. Okay. Well, I don't really want to carry that back with me. I got four just making metal. Um, let's see. What do I got downstairs? I have some storage boxes down here too. And uh, let's see. What do we got? Uh, empty. Okay. Someone robbed me. Okay, here's some useless stuff. Oh, more, uh, I'll take the blue blueprints, though. I'll, uh, just load up my bookshelf that I made. Okay. Well, what the heck? I thought I had some crystal here. I don't know what... Well, maybe they're in the smithy. I guess, maybe. Let's see. Oh, there it is! Yay! Yay, crystal! Go back up to the pteranodon. <laughs> Holy crap, okay, there's a lot of stairs. Uh, they don't... They, they don't call me fatty for nothing. Uh, Alright. Okay, your turn to do some work. Oh, God. Okay, need to start working out some more. Uh, let's, let's stop off at the uh, vegetable garden here. Grab some veggies since we're in the area, because I don't have anything growing back at the trap yet. And here we go. Let's see, we got some taters. Let's see, I think that's a tater. Yep, taters. Give me some taters and I'll get some carrots. Okay, so on my way home, I was, you know, minding my own business, and I saw some equus over here. Level 95, that's the highest one that's around here right now. And I know what you're thinking, fatty. 
Remember what happened last time? Stupid damn horse had brain worms or something going on. But I've really matured since then. I feel like I've come a long way. And, you know, I've just gotten really good at putting carrots in horses' butts since then. So let's see. Just a little sneak action. Got my carrot ready. Put some up his butt. And come on, here we go. There we go. Oh, God. Oh, he didn't like it. Okay, time to go. Okay, uh, hey, what are you running for? He must have saw me put the carrot up his butt. Yeah, I'd probably be running too. All right, there he is. Let's see. Okay, he's running wild. He's running all over the place. Let's see, maybe he's gonna slow down here pretty soon. If I get far enough away, maybe he'll slow down and calm his butt down. Slow your roll, man. Slow your roll. Let's see, where is he? There he is, okay. By the rocks. He's running around. Oh, he slowed down. Well, okay, that was quick. Let's see, come in for landing. Don't run off as soon as I get there, please. Okay, let's see. Come up from behind. And ride him, and ride him. Woo, yeah, baby. Oh, oh God, he kicked me. Oh, good. <sighs> Wait, stop. No. Come here. Stop, stop. I said stop. Don't listen to me. No, don't fight him. Dang it. All right, let's see. Maybe he'll slow down again. Okay, I'll just fly above him. Since I'm not chasing after him, really, maybe he'll slow down again. All right, ran through the water, ran into a rock. He's not the smartest tool in the shed. Where are you going? No, don't you do it. Don't you do it. Don't you dare do it. Oh my God, what an idiot. Where are you running to? You're running into walls. All right, looks like I'll follow him until he calms down. All right, so this horse likes water, apparently, and uh, well, he's headed for the only island that's out here right now. So hopefully, I'll just land here and shh, be quiet. Don't scare him off. Die! Kill him! Hurry up! Hurry up! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! <laughs> Nothing's going on over here. All right, do a little butt action again, and oh, here we go. Here, take that. You like that carrot? Yeah. Oh, right. And back to this way. All right. Well, okay. This is probably the most boring Equus Tame ever. I'm just riding him in the water. Okay. I guess. This is pretty easy. Um... Not sure what to do now. I guess I win? I, I win arc, I guess? I don't know. What's what's going on here? I, I, okay, I guess I'm just done now? I, what the heck was that about? Come here. Uh, you're, okay, you, you're just gonna drown yourself, I guess? You're, okay, yeah, just screw life, right? Okay, can't ride him. Yes, I would like to ride him, please. Can I, can I, thank you, no, yes. All right, so he's done with me and that's it. All right, looks like I'm making my way back to the Pteranodon then. All right, so he's still swimming. Here he is, he went out to the ocean like an idiot and uh, just following him here, waiting for him to go back to the ocean. Oh crap, uh, here, get him, get that Megalodon. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Distract him. Oh, God, that was close. I almost jumped in the water with the Megalodon. Okay, well, at least it, uh... Okay, well, it gave him a chance to get away. But now he's freaking running again. Man, this is gonna be the worst tame. He's gonna have 0% taming effectiveness now. Come on. Come here, let me ride you. yee Woo! Yeah. Ah, God. What the heck? I didn't have carrots in there? What is that? Come on. Ugh, what a nightmare. Right, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let me land, let me try this again. Ugh, come here, come here, come here, come here. Slow down. Slow down. Yeah, run into that, run into that rock. Let me ride you. I can't see anything. What the heck is this? Let me ride him. What the heck is going on, art gods? Let me ride him. All right, come on, and okay, he's about to take my carrot, eat my carrot. 
Alright, so I found this idiot out here. Slow down. Spazzy McCrazy Pants walking along and. Okay, here, ride him. Let me ride. Uh, what is going on? Alright, come back and ride. Uh, ride. Uh, slow down, slow down. Run into something. Come here! Just get tired of running. Come on! Yes, get him! Here, take my carrot. Alright, he's riding, he's riding. Okay, stay on him. Don't get bucked off now. And here, take my carrot. Yeah! Name my Equus. Finally! Holy crap. Alright, do your little prance thing. Okay, that's a buck. Okay, he can bite, he can buck. There's your little nay. That's what I'm talking about. Do it again. Alright, finally. Well, this Equus was a pain in the butt. He was probably more trouble than he was worth. He was only level 95. I didn't get any kind of taming bonus because he was bitten by sharks. I hit him several times. He ran into water, almost drowned himself. All kinds of crazy stuff. Ugh, just want to go home. Okay, so, uh, just arrived home, and look what I see here. A level 135. And, uh, let's see, okay, I got carrot for it. Yeah, one, 135, Equus. And, uh, look how close I am to my place. He's, like, literally walking in to the trap right now. You need to calm down, Mr. Turn It On, because you're driving me crazy. All right, you stay put too. I've gotten pretty good at putting carrots up horses' butts, so let's try this. Okay, there we go. Here, uh, okay, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Uh, can you slow down for a second? Get stuck on something. Run into that dodo. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, man. All right, come back. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, ah, come here. Ah, stupid tree. And come here, come here, come here. Uh, yes. Here, take that. Woo, yeah. Here, take a carrot. All right. He's hypnotized. All right, come on. Take my carrots. And don't get bitten or attacked by anything. Don't find any water to try to drown yourself in. All right, now this is what it should be like. No bucking off, just... A nice ride with a horse, running into rocks and stuff. Man, these horses ain't too smart. Come on. Do your little buck thing again. Here you go, take my carrot. Yeah. All right. He's a little hypnotized again with my carrot. And one more should do it, come on. Okay, you like going in circles, I get it. Hello, Mr. Gallimimus. All right. There we go, here, yeah, yeah, yes, sir, woohoo, all right, all right, so we made it back home, and uh, I went through and I did a little bit of naming of the dinos, I had a little bit of naming party going on, we'll start on the far left here, on the far left we have Mr. T, the gamer, next to him we have Nightwing, then we have Inferno, the level 26 fire wyvern. Then next to him we have Seahorse slash Idiot Dumb Nuts. And then we have Razorback 3000, the Allosaurus. Next to him we have Spirit Wraith. He tamed up at 202, that's not too shabby. Then we have Frostbite, the Ice Wyvern. Last but not least we have Hades, level 85. He just became fully grown. So. All right, guys, are you all ready for the photo? Tell everyone thanks for coming and hanging out with us today. All right? All right, should I strike a pose like this for the photo? Huh, is that cool? That's the, that's the, that's the cool thing now, I think, right? No, okay. All right, everyone get in the photo. Tell everyone thanks for coming to hang out with us today. All right, guys, you ready? 
Here we go. Three, two, one. Seahorse slash idiot dumb nuts, stop making that stupid face. Bye. Views? Views for the poor? Do you have any spare views? <laughs>